Hey guys! So today I have a finger paints collection for you again, and this time it is called the Enchanted Mermaid collection, and it's made up of these four polishes right here. And as you can see, it's greens and blues, and then this white. So I, okay, so I've seen this in my Sally's for a little while. And I was planning on picking it up because I could tell that this was a collection full of duochromes and they're blues and greens. So I thought this is going to be amazing. And no joke, the colors are amazing. I love them so much. However, this is a textured collection and I did not know that when I picked it up. I needed to read the fine print. In fact, on the display, it says with mermaid tail texture. So even though it's a textured collection, you think to yourself, well, that's not really going to deter her because she likes texture. The thing of it is, is I think that they took it a little bit too far in this one with the mermaid tail texture. So let me go ahead and just show you what I'm talking about. So this is my favorite color of the collection. It's on my nails. It's a blue and purple pink duochrome. It's so pretty, but the texture that they added here it's like lumpy. You can tell that it's little particles in there that are covered in the polish, but what ends up happening is it looks lumpy. It's not even, um, and so because of that, it just looks very um, distracting. It really takes away from the color, so it's super unfortunate, um, but <laughs> if they had just left the texture out, these colors would be so beautiful. So. I'm just going to go ahead and show them to you. Um, the one that's on my nail is called Sailor's Lure. So this is the one that's the blue, green, and pink, and the shift is so gorgeous. I mean, if you can look past the lumpiness, um, I think you'll really like this one. However, I wanted to make sure and let you know that um, it's going to look like this. So let's look at this watch and you can see what I'm talking about. All right, so distracting, right? It's way too lumpy. It's kind of crazy. So maybe they'll re-release these all without the lumps. Just kidding. They probably won't. But anyway, let's move on. The next one is called Tales of Love. This one is more green um, than the last one. It's predominantly like teal and then blue, and it has some um, pink in there. Just really gorgeous duochromes. This one even has some little bits of shimmer. So um, Tales of Love. Let's look at this one. And then the third one is called Underwater Enchantress. And as you can see, it's much more green. It's a green, gold, and blue duochrome. Super pretty, just like the other two that I've already shown you, but the same exact texture problem. Let's look. And then the fourth one that they include, um, I was almost thinking of not picking this up, but I did just for the sake of having the whole collection to review for you. And um, I was actually really surprised with how much I liked this one. Now, I have to say, I still didn't like the texture, um, but I'm speaking of the color. I really like the color. And it, it just looks like it's going to be like a regular white that flashes a little bit pink, but it's actually really opalescent on the nail. And I actually ended up liking it a lot. So let's take a look at this watch.
All right, so you've seen all four colors. What did you guys think? Um, I know that some of you have commented that you're kind of over the whole texture thing. Um, if this is the direction that the texture trend is going, I'm going to start to be over it pretty soon too. I mean, it's just, um, honestly, it's a little gimmicky. I really wish that they would have just left it without the texture. This would have just been, um, I would have just totally recommended this whole collection to you fully. And yeah, it's kind of a bummer, but like I said, they are still pretty. And if you want to just look, hi, if you want to just uh, look past the texture, you might really like it. So anyway, I hope you're having a great day and I hope this helped you decide if you want to pick any of these up. Don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss any of my videos and I'll see you back next time. Bye.